let us move this country away from the politics of ethnicity, from division, and let us have a clear plan on how we want to move Kenya to the next level. Our agenda is to ensure that we create jobs for those who don't have jobs. We ensure that we support those who can do business, decriminalize the business environment, and make sure that there is government support to support enterprise. We also ensure that our farmers across the country are planting the right crops, getting the right advice, getting the right financing, getting the correct returns, and accessing the correct markets, and ensuring that everybody carries an equal burden of our taxes, whether it is in NHIF, whether it is in NSSF, every one of us carries an equal burden, and that those who are lower in the scale are not paying more than those of us who are on top of the scale. And that's why we are saying a bottom-up economic model where we start with those who don't have jobs to get priority by implementing government policy that ensures we create jobs. Those whose businesses are small, we support them, provide them financing, create the correct environment, decriminalize the enterprise, and ensure that we support them so that we can grow our economy from the bottom. Ensure that our farmers have the correct advice, they get the correct earnings, they have access to the correct markets, and that they are getting the correct support in the whole chain, all the way through agro-processing value, through agro-processing value addition to manufacturing. And again, ensuring that everybody gets to carry an equivalent load of our taxes. That is how we are going to move Kenya to the next level. The reason why I requested for this meeting is that I wanted to explain myself to you and to persuade you that I have a plan worth implementing. I have also told you that plan is not complete. I want it enriched by you people from Western Kenya to make it uh, uh, sensitive to the priorities that you think uh, will, 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 will help Western Kenya move faster. And then let us commit ourselves to an implementation plan so that we stop government that is just government for the sake of government. I am prepared to be held to account because I have no doubt in my capacity to deliver. I'm going to speak from my experience as the first director of Vision 2030 Secretariat in this country. And I can tell you, my good colleagues, that whatever the, His Excellency, the Deputy President, has presented to us is exactly the kind of model that transformed many countries that never had any natural resources to be first economies today, the likes of Singapore, the likes of South Korea. So it's doable, and I would like us to leave this place to believe that with the right strategies in place that we are going to put as uh, uh, professionals, this is very doable. Politics, the way Your Excellency have stated, and I have noted it down, politics is a game of interest. But nobody has ever defined to us what is political interest. That's why, at the end of the day, some people think the interest in politics is grouping as a community, then getting leadership.